Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. I hope you all are well. So today I filmed this everyday drugstore slash affordable makeup look for you guys. It's just a really simple, easy, everyday look you can do if you're on the run. You just want to throw something on, but you still want to look put together. So it's really simple eye, really nice glowy skin, nice neutral lip. And I used all drugstore slash affordable products. And I also showed you guys how I tie my little... um. Hey, if you have any other questions, just leave them down below. I'll try my best to get back to everyone. And I just want to thank you guys so much for all your support and your love. It really means the world to me. So, um, without further ado, let's get into this video and I'll see you guys in my next one. Bye. So, I'm using my NYX Ultimate Warm Palette and I'm taking that orange shade and I'm going to put that in my crease with my Bare Minerals Crease Defining Brush. And this is going to be our first transition color. <laughs> Now I'm taking this reddish brown shade and I'm going to put that directly over top of that last color just to build up some definition and depth in my crease area. Now I'm just taking a clean blending brush to blend out any harsh lines and I'm going to go in with my NYX glitter primer and apply that all over my lid to prep for the shimmery color that we're going to apply. And we're going to use this prismatic shadow from NYX called Rose Dust. And I'm going to apply this all over my lid with the flat synthetic brush. I'm just going to go back with the same brush that I was using before to make sure everything is well blended. And then I'm going to take these two matte highlight shades and I'm going to put that on my brow bone. Now moving on to the face, I'm going to take my pore filler primer from NYX and my Maybelline Fit Me Matte and Poreless Foundations and I'm going to apply this all over my face with a brush that I got from eBay. For concealer, I'm taking my NYX HD Concealer in the shade Caramel, and I really like this color because it's nice and yellow, so it's going to help to brighten everything, so I'm just applying this underneath my eye, um, on my chin, and on my cupid's bow, and I'm going to blend it out with a Real Techniques Beauty Sponge. To set everything in place, I'm taking this banana powder from Ruby Kisses. And I really do like this powder. The only downside about it is that it can cause flashbacks. So I'll just take a brush and put a little bit on, then wipe off the excess. So I'm just putting that powder wherever I put my concealer. So underneath my eye, on my nose, and Cupid's bow area. <laughs> To contour slash bronze my face, I'm taking my NYX No Filter Powder just to add some color back into my face. So I'm applying that on my cheekbones, my forehead, and my nose. For highlighter, I'm taking this one by Wet n Wild and I'm just applying this on my cheekbones down the bridge of my nose, chin, you know, everywhere you normally highlight, and I'm using a Morphe M510 brush. For blush, I'm using this NYX Ombre blush in the shade Nude to Me, and I'm just applying this right in between my highlight and my contour area to kind of blend everything together and make it look more seamless. And I always like to go on with the clean powder brush just to blend everything together and make sure there are no harsh lines. Back to the eyes, I'm taking that burgundy color. I'm going to smudge that really close to my lash line. And then I'm going to take a fluffier blending brush just to smoke it out even more. I'm going to take this shimmery gold color and I'm going to apply that in my inner corners and also on my brow bone. Now because this is an everyday look, I don't wear false lashes on a daily basis, so I'm just going to apply a few coats of mascara to my top and bottom lashes. Ones. 
Moving on to the lips, I'm gonna line my lips with this brown lip liner from NYX called Cappuccino, and I'm also gonna slightly fill them in. The lip color that I'm gonna apply is from NYX as well, and it's one of their soft matte lip creams in the shade Dubai, and I'm just gonna apply that all over my lips. And to finish off the look, I'm just going to spray my face with my NYX Dewy Finishing Spray. And I'm just putting on my head scarf because I don't want to get my hair wet. So now I'm just going to show you guys how I apply my head scarf. This is just a regular scarf that you can find at your local beauty supply store. And I just put it on my head the back way so that the two long parts are in the front of my um, face and I'm just going to smooth out my hair make sure it's all tucked into my scarf and make sure that it's all nice and flat and smooth and then I'm just going to start twisting it so I'm going to twist it and then wrap it around the bun and twist it again and wrap it around the bun and you're just going to continue to do that until you run out of scarf <laughs> And you just want to keep playing with it and adjusting it until you get it the way you like. And the way I like to secure mine is by taking a rubber band and just tying it around the bun. Now you can also use bobby pins or try to get a scrunchie that's kind of similar to the color of your scarf so it camouflages more. But I'm just wrapping the rubber band around the bun and then I'm just going to tuck everything in and make sure that the rubber band is not showing. Mirror, mirror. 